Hello and welcome back to Volatility 411. I'm Kevin Davitt, part of SIBO's Options Institute, and this is Monday, December 21st. Happy start of winter. Now, last week, the U.S. equity markets made new all-time highs across the board. Small cap, large cap, big tech, all higher last week as the VIX index fell back into the low 20s. Today, however, things look different despite a last-minute stimulus deal from Congress and Tesla being added to the S&P 500. S&P 500 futures sold off hard in the overnight session, at one point trading down about 2.5% or 125 handles to the red. There's meaningful concern about a potentially new strain of coronavirus that's feared to be far more transmissible. The United Kingdom imposed much stricter measures in an effort to stem the spread there. There's also yet another deadline passed in Brexit negotiations with the EU. The VIX index briefly measured above 30 prior to the U.S. cash market open. January VIX futures, which are now front month, traded as high as 27.80. As of recording, the S&P 500 has paired losses and is lower by about 1%. The VIX index is now measuring around 26. The January futures are trading 20, 26 and a quarter, with February about one handle higher and the back of the curve very flat. Now, on the options side of the board, there's a few January call spreads trading in early action. More than 8,000 of the Jan 26, 28 call spreads traded for 59 cents. And then the Jan 32 half, 37 half call spreads traded for 63 cents. This will be a holiday shortened week with a half day for cash equities on Thursday and markets closed on Friday for Christmas. The economic calendar is quite light with consumer confidence and new home sales data due. So as we march toward the end of 2020, yet another reminder that COVID is with us and perhaps in a new form. Happy holidays to all. Thanks for watching this year and please stay tuned in 2021.